Hey guys, Scott on Football here, back with another video. Today, Stafford Rangers take on Whitby Town at home. After coming off the back of a 2 1 defeat on Easter Monday at Games Maturity, it is vital we aim for three points today, like we did against Barabris and Workington, where we won two on the bounce. But this season, we never seem to go three unbeaten or um, three unbeaten or win three games in a row. We never seem to do that. But today, um, Bradford Park Avenue and Avalon can both get relegated, but we really need Bradford to beat Baseford and, and us to beat Whitby so we can close the gap to that three points again. So who thought with four games remaining we'd still be in the relegation battle? Nobody thought that. So as long as we give it 110% today against Whitby, that's all that concerns me. Three points needs to be a priority, but we... But I'll be happy if we don't lose today. But three points is a must, really. We'll be our decent side. We have had some decent games in them over the years. We, they haven't beaten us here since 2013, which is always a good record to have against a team like this. We, I don't think Whitby will get in the playoff because pretty much they'll have to win their fight, all their get all their games, and the other teams lose around them. So perhaps it probably won't be much for them to play for, really. But we'll soon see. My prediction for today is going to be 2-1 to Stafford Rangers. This was made before games were game, but I am sticking to it now. I'll see you all in the ground. Keep it going, lads.
Full-time score finished. Step of Rangers one, Whitby Town nil. What a massive three points that is for us. Bradford lost two one. Uh, uh, Bradford beat Baseford two one today, which was a massive win for us. And Everton lost three 0 away at Augustine. Really good results all round for us, with them all going our way. Cameron Anderson is absolutely magic. He has been a lot of this season. It will been for him for one to one the the games that we have. I thought the first half were the better team. Second half, it was pretty equal between both teams. I thought it was a pretty game, especially with the wind howling in the background. I think it was, it, it was a very really close game, like it was against Workington. Well, in those two games, haven't been the best performance for us, but we've put a shift in and seen the sort seen the game out. Something that we've struggled to do all season. At the end of the day, r results over performances. I'm ha I'm happy to play bad if we win the game, instead of playing well but losing. You... Hope, um, next Saturday we take on Everton Collier's way. This is a massive game for us and it's a must win. Where Baseford have got two tough games coming up against Macclesfield and Radcliffe. They're really tough for them. So if we can win, that will put us level on points. And then followed by Aston at home, who are, who are the playoff hopefuls and looking to, to get a spot in the playoffs. If we live to fight another day, and we a new thought with three games remaining, we'll still be in this. We need all the support we can away at Everton Collar, Collar next Saturday. 
Well done to Rangers today on, on the result. And we go again, and we go again next Saturday. Congrats to Jimmy O'Neill on his Malabats. I think that's deserved, personally. I will, I will be going to the game away over to next week. So, if you, And I will wrap this video up now. So if you did all enjoy the video, do get a like, do subscribe to the channel, and turn on your notifications every time I make a video. I'll see you all next sat Saturday at Everton Colliers. Enjoy the rest of the evening. Bye, bye everyone. Up the borough!